Hey, uh, how's it going, folks? Uh, Rooster here in Tennessee. As promised, we're uh, continuing on with our uh, uh, pile of radios that, that I said we'd be going through. And uh, we're just going through them one at a time. Hopefully, you'll see some radios that maybe you've never seen before. And uh, hopefully, I'll uh, shoot, shoot on some radios that I've never seen before or some that I've never owned before. Uh, this one would fall into the I've never owned before category. Uh, Uniden Pro 810E. I've never owned one of these radios before. So kind of cool that I uh, came across this and the pile of stuff and uh, we get to do a video on it here. Uh, now the significance of this radio is it's a uh, sideband radio. Now it doesn't have anything beyond regular 40. Um, you have your regular 40 channels, but uh, if you're a sideband operator, it does have sideband on it. Um, and this radio is actually, uh, you know, it's a, I guess it would make a good beginner radio for someone that's uh, into sideband. Um, not a lot of features, nothing confusing on it, um, and it can be purchased for a reasonable price. And we'll start from left to right and go over everything. Of course, we've got our mic jack here, obviously. It's a four-pin Uniden mic, so Galaxy, Cobra, Uniden, all those mics will work on it. Uh, mic gain, of course. Um, our speaker. We can turn our volume up and hear some static. Noise blanker, uh, PA, your uh, high cut for receive. Um, Volume squelch, RF gain, your modes, AM, sideband, upper sideband, lower sideband, clarifier, which is obviously a must for a sideband operation. And then we've got our channel nine over here. Uh, channel nine, for uh, anyone that doesn't know, as technically it's the emergency channel. Um, now I'm not sure today if you had an emergency, if you turn to channel nine, if you would get a hold of anyone. I'm not sure if there's an emergency service that monitors that. I know, um, I don't think all of our local police have CB radios. Maybe some of them do. Um, I've, I've really never tried it. So I've never got on channel nine and I called for an emergency. So I don't know if it's still a respected channel for emergencies or not. Uh, the radio itself is in decent shape. Um, looking you know looking at what we're seeing right now you'd say man that thing's actually in really good shape uh, other than what we see here and what we see here is the significance we've got some corrosion going on here so general rule of thumb on our radios for me is where you see a little corrosion you're probably going to see more corrosion because that means there's been some moisture uh, at one time or another to some degree now that doesn't mean this thing's been saturated in water but as you can see uh, we've had, you know, whether it was just in a moist, damp area that it was being stored in, uh, we've got some accumulation of some moisture here. Now, that being said, this radio still functions, okay? So, if this doesn't bother you, or if you have a replacement plate for this radio, by all means, this would be a good radio for you because it does work. Speaking of it working, let's uh, get into the output test of it and see what it does 50 watt scale we're going to start out on average just for kicks okay hello radio one two three you can hear it in the background and we're just doing four watts four watts average power that's all it does pretty sure it's a stock radio maybe had a little bit done to it let's see what it does for peak Hello radio one two three. 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 Between twenty and twenty five watts peak, and that's uh, not bad. You know what? Let's see what it does on on sideband just for kicks. We'll go to upper sideband and see what it does. I wasn't thinking. Uh, it is a sideband radio, so what the heck? Why not see what it does on sideband, right? Hello radio one two three. Hello radio one two three. So just a little bit more on sideband. Hello radio one two three. Hello radio one two three. And uh, obviously no carrier on sideband. Hello radio one two three. Twenty five watts peak on a sideband. Uh, there it is. Uh, you know, this radio, I've seen these things. I, I looked it up earlier. Um, they brought some pretty wild prices on eBay. Not looking to get a crazy price out of this thing, okay? It's got the corrosion on the bottom of it, so it's not something we're going to ask an arm and a leg for. 
um, you know, selling this thing, I'd like to see someone get it that is just getting into radios. Uh, you know, the whole keep the hobby alive thing, right? And this would make someone a great starter radio. Um, so if you guys are interested in this thing, let me know. Uh, keep in mind, if you have someone that you're trying to get into CB radio, um, this would be a great one to start them out on. And uh, I'll make somebody a good deal on it, especially if uh, that is the case. Okay, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Catch you out there, 73s.